My mother in the fucking rehab nursing home watched more of the Super Bowl than I did. And I'm wearing my Super Bowl credential. And some of you folks may be going, what am I missing here? Did you cover it? Johnny, I covered everything but the game. I had no desire to go to the game. I, I was there all weekend. I covered the uh, Hall of Fame announcements, all the awards. I did all the Radio Row. You guys saw on, I did the live from Radio Row. Um, I interviewed a lot of fans at bars and, you know, at the outdoor events, the Super Bowl live events. Um, all the, you know, like I said, the Hall of Famers, things like that. And I got in the airport Sunday morning, and I had no desire. And I'm going to explain exactly why I did. I'm going to do a nose-nose on it, too, because some people are probably like, Oh, yeah, I thought you said you boycotted. You, I'll, I'll explain. Uh, Johnny gets it. Of course Johnny gets it. Johnny's Johnny, Johnny, Johnny. I love to call him. I call him. I like him so much I say his name three times. You know, I agree, Joe. She is cute. Tiff. Yeah, right, Gav? You, would, you wouldn't fucking throw her out of bed, right? Maybe if you just wanted to fuck on the floor quick. <laughs> Did I see Aaron Andrews? No, I, I was joking around. Who said that to me on the, uh, was Kephas on the live? I said I should have a peephole costume, like a peephole mask if I saw her, and, and, and wear it and go, Get it, Aaron! <laughs> Let me see your cunt! You know, that would be pretty fucking funny. Last time. Is the Creel Chris bra working for me? He's working with me, and no one works for me. That's such a gay thing. I'm the boss! That was an ironic douche thing. The bud What's up, pals? Can I work with you? Yes, you can. <laughs> I have a position right here, a position for you. It's called Girl on Top. <laughs> That'll land me in HR. Oh. <laughs> it's there. When he wants it, it's there, his foreskin, if he does not get circumcised. Like a dick. The wolf on the hill needs the circumcised cock. <laughs> the one climbing the hill does, I mean. The one on the hill is uncircumcised. Jared's journey. What's up, bro? Nothing much, you? Not much, bro. Just got back in town yesterday. I actually got the ma magazine today. Oh, very cool. Thank you, bro. Crystal, yeah. please unblock him so you can see this. <laughs> Nick, here he comes, our pal. <laughs> oh, here he is. <laughs> How the hell are you, Mr. J, my friend? I'm uh, fine, uh, Mighty Ball and Joel. But like I said uh, in the first line, I'm back. Uh, I did let him... I'm going to give you a hint. They're ladies. Ah, uh, even uh, much uh, greater. Um, Your favorite female bodybuilders, Mr. J. They're going to be doing a show together talking about sex. Ah. Uh, I, personally, I would actually prefer for them to be talking about torture, but uh, with that, have uh, my brain's blood flow and the air perpetually squeezed from me by them both for all the time <laughs> forever. Here is Mr. J's artwork. It is a, I call it a diorama of destruction or something I called it. Uh, and it is basically what he wants the female bodybuilders to do to him, to squeeze the life out of him so his eyes bulge out of his head more than they do normally. Yes. And, my, and cut off my brain's blood flow, so on and so forth. Kim Haynes, what? finesse. We were just talking about you. A good way, of course. We were talking about Mr. Johnson masturbating to the new show. Fit Chicks Chat, Friday, 8 p.m. this week. On the 8th of February, on crystal.wildfire.anthony, Kim and Crystal will be talking about skinless chicken and that 10th rep. Yes. It's going to be training. It's going to be training talk. I'm so excited. I can't wait. Oh, I can't wait. You know I'm masturbating to it. You know. Even if there's a house full of people there. <laughs> Florida is too damn hot. Yeah, when there's three feet of snow in Rochester, you're going to wish you were back in that fucking Florida heat. I can see if you said there was too many Hispanics there, then I would agree with you. <laughs> you're too fucking correct. Too many Hispanics in California. Yes, I feel like Tom Brokaw. I'm going to get in trouble like Tom Brokaw. 
Yes, the brown people, they don't assimilate enough. Everything he said, I agreed with 1,000%. There's like fucking three blocks left of Little Italy. It's a, it's a tourist trap. People go, oh, it's great. No, it sucks. It's shit. I can tell you some good places to go to right on Mulberry, maybe a little bit off Mulberry in Little Italy, but most of the places that people go to are garbage and they're tourist traps. Hey, buddy. Welcome to Mikey Crazy Hawk's favorite show, LegalSteroids.com presents Gearing Up. <laughs> List the next. <laughs> I banged Autumn to Kim's calendar. <laughs> oh, my God. Ray, I love you. You're right. a... BJ and the Bear, a bloke took some Viagra and fucked his missus five hours. He had an erection. His missus said, are you going to finally call a doctor? The guy replies, no, I'm calling your sisters. All right. Yes, and if they eat each other, it's like the MSM family. <laughs> Mom for 23, what's up, sweetie? You got to put more, more pictures. I go to your page to like more pictures, and the same ones are up there. Show your tits! <laughs> what about um, Liam Neeson is my new favorite actor. <laughs> I, I always liked him, and now I love him. <laughs> it indexes every huge porn site. Oh, really? Okay. It's like Google for porn. Shit, dude. We've been keeping it a secret from my dick all this time. <laughs> time to jerk off the fifth on the Kim's calendar. <laughs> oh, it's Jessie's. We can sing happy birthday to her, too. Happy birthday. I want to blow her candles as well. <laughs> I'd let a fucking candle strap on me. It won't hurt that bit. Because <laughs> it's small, you know. Um, happy birthday to Adam and Jesse. Yes, and to Kim. Yourself. Don't leave yourself out of that fucking threesome. <laughs> Adam, how long would it take you to come if you had Ink Jesse and Kim Haynes in the fucking fart sack at the same time? Like, it, it could, would you measure it in seconds or minutes? And don't tell me hours, because I know you're lying then. Or maybe you're gay. <laughs> maybe you're lying. <laughs> but how? Welcome to LegalSteroids.com. Presents Gearing Up right here. They have a great sale going on. For your honey, for your honey, you can get her a gift and save some money. Valentine's Day week sale. The whole week of Valentine's Day, which is, of course, the 14th of this month. 25% off of LegalSteroids.com. It's also SDI Labs. And you use the code VAL25, V-A-L-25. And they also have a President's Day sale for President's Day, but that's the 18th. The week after that, and it's also 25%. Yes, Cat Vong and C-Dubs and their favorite drink, Woodward, will be a flowing in Ohio. The 28th of this month, that's when we shoot down there, which is my son's birthday. So I'm going to like probably be in the doghouse, but I don't get fucking pussy at home anyway. So what is the difference? What is she going to do? Hold out on me even more? <laughs> I'm like, what? I can fight with her all day long. What is she going to do? Shut me out? <laughs> I got the upper hand if I don't get fucking laid at home. I don't have nothing to lose. I can say whatever the fuck I want and get in trouble because it doesn't matter. <laughs> Us Italians are sexophones. Yes, unfortunately, a uh, half Italian, half Irish wife. I guess the Irish part went into her pussy. <laughs> I may have to fucking like sneak heroin into her coffee. <laughs> it is a new sweet and low. <laughs> <laughs> and then I would just eat her ass for an hour and spread it and fuck it. Who would win in a glass eating contest? Big Rob will eat a glass eating contest. Big Rob, because he's already he's already survived a few fucking and fucking the ISIS training explosions. <laughs> That's not nice to say that, Joe. <laughs> oh, go suck a dick, Mister Magoo. <laughs> I'll suck a big black dick. I smell cum after that burp. You should. It's yours. <laughs> you recognize it? <laughs> I haven't cheated on you since this morning. <laughs> I tried to blow myself, but I couldn't reach. So I didn't have another fucking load washing yours down. <laughs> you want to get high and not work out. Do, does does getting high get you laid and get you paid? Because if it does, then I, 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 I'm going to tell you to stick with what you're doing. But working out's going to get you to fucking feel better, live longer, and you're going to look better, so you're going to get pussy. So even if you, don't, you hate going to the gym because it's annoying and it's boring, think the payoff at the end of the road, you might get a chick to put a tongue on your ball sack because of it. You know, I mean, that, that, that's, that's what keeps everybody going. Calming music. It sounds like... This sounds like the music you hear when you're getting jerked off in a fucking rubbing tug. Ah, uh, where's Chris Bra? I wanted to hear it. I'm playing his song. 
You guys buy this fucking calendar so you can fucking jerk off like I do to it. Every fucking five minutes. Holy Toledo. Thank you. If a, for, thank you for the new subscribers. I've gotten a bunch of new subscribers lately. Hey, it me. Yes, that is you, Kimmy Kim. This reminds me of laying back and, and, and getting my fucking dick pulled by a fucking oriental fucking bitch for 60 bucks and getting a fucking massage a whole fucking half hour and she's just fucking pulling with the beautiful fucking baby oil all over it oh god i miss rubbing tongues welcome to titan medical center presents ask me anything msm style are you for octavio cortez cunt kennedy's fucking green new deal please don't tell me you are because I, I, I it's it's to me it's it's a fucking comedy that's real life I want everyone to listen up. You know, Big Rob. There's nothing wrong with that. Of course, we all know and love him. Sometimes. Yeah, he's just confused. He's he's he doesn't like the trolling. Like I didn't like the trolling. We can relate. I didn't like the trolling before, but now I understand. You guys are playing around with me. He doesn't understand. He thinks you guys are serious. Okay. Well, and he's that, a little he's a little fucked up. If you know if you know what I'm saying. The the reason why I'm not using that language. Because I don't want bad publicity. And I'm okay. you don't need it. I, it's too late for me. I've been saying it. My first word was cunt, I think, when I was a, a, a one-year-old. That's not I what you know. wanted to do. I would never do anything negative. Humanity is about doing positive things. I would only keep the positivity in w this organization if I'm the leader. Okay? Big Rob is just, he's become a joke of his own joke existence. I mean, he is just, a fucking paramecium has more fucking reason to be on this earth than that fucking piece of dog shite. You can fuck Ariana. One requirement, though, she has to be knocked out on Quaalude, totally unconscious. You cannot get it in. Do you hit it? You cannot get in trouble. Ariana Grande, the real one? Of course. Yes, what do you think? If I can't get in trouble, even if I could, I just run fast. <laughs> you can't catch me. I'm not that fucking old yet. I can still run. We can't trust Team Humanity. Of course we can. Or do you want you talking about Ariana's biggest fan, the, the man behind the account? I have to fuck him. Uh, then I wouldn't do it because I'm not gay. I've never tried. I would love to hear you and Hulk Hogan talk about daughters being with black guys. I'd put him to shame, bro. <laughs> and I don't give a fuck if people don't watch my show because of that. Hulk Hogie, can you dig it, sucker? <laughs> Have you ever wrestled a lady boy with your pants off? Um, yes. <laughs> Actually, yes. Man, I used to fucking bang some of these old and fucking broads. And I, that's, I guess, where I became such a filthy animal, where I suck toes and eat ass and all of that.